evening, everyone. Today, nonprofits throughout the GEM state are working to get donations to support their various missions. Local News 8's Bree Clark joining us in the studio. Bree, organizations say this could be the most support they get in the entire year. Well, you know what, Carol? Just take a look right behind me. This is their website here, and you can see we have less than six hours left um, in people being able to give. And it's a little hard to see that number over there, but they have already beat last year's goal. 780,000 is what they got this year. This year it's $856,000. And that's money that could make a big difference for companies that these organizations support. What makes us human? What inspires us? You know, we all have that need to create. The Idaho Art Lab is just one of 90 nonprofit groups that are participating in Idaho Gives. These little rural towns, we often feel kind of alone in our struggle. Um, but the Idaho Art Lab is trying to network artists together and give them a place to come and create. But art groups aren't the only ones in need of help. On the Broadway Bridge in downtown, groups gather to get the word out. Going out and doing uh, a push for revenue is really hard. And vital to downtown's future since more than half of the nonprofits throughout the region are based in the heart of Idaho Falls. A lot of our local businesses have teamed up with local nonprofits to spread their mission, to spread their word, and to help increase the funds that are given to those nonprofits. And many businesses are doing specials. You know, you may buy a drink and get one free or an entree and get one free, things like that. The Arts Council is also putting on their annual gallery walk. And in many of these businesses, iPads and computers will be set up for people to donate online. That's the only way you're able to donate live here in the studio. I'm Bree Clark. All right. Thanks, Bree. To donate, you can find a link on our website, and that is localnews8.com.